Hi, I have a hat on. I know you expect to see the reaction video, but and you will soon, but I wanted to let everyone know, in all seriousness, go to the community tab on Whitney's page and look for the post that says regulars merch round to sign up and put your name down, okay? And that's how you will get on the shirt. There's gonna be one post on the community tab. That's gonna be the official place to get your name on the shirt, okay? It is there now. Put your name on it. You will be on the shirt. <laughs> now, we're gonna react. We sit right there. We use this tripod. We eat these snacks. We're doing it now. Ugh, okay. Hi. Hey. Let's just tell them what's going on. So, uh, um. Like in our lives emotionally? Yeah, not a great week. No, it has not been a great week. Um. We're really tired. Sonny hasn't really been sleeping great and we're also transitioning him into a big bed. So I feel like that could be a while of dealing with that. And I think running on no sleep obviously then affects how you handle everything during the day. And I have just not been in a good place and then it's rubbing off on him and we just haven't been in the best spirits. No, but we're devoted to you and to making hilarious reaction videos. Everything is fine, so don't yeah. freak out. Yeah, don't freak It's all like normal quarantine, being on top of each other, being tired, having Working a lot together, to do. Having a toddler, being sensitive people, all of it, just that's what it equals. So yeah. we didn't want to just film reaction videos and not be honest with you. Yeah. Plus, we want to start folding in parts of our real lives into these videos. Too. Yeah, I think that that is important. But, but I already feel like even filming you feel has better? put you in a better mood. I do like to film. <laughs> um, all right, well, I love you. I love you, too. And it's all normal stuff. Yeah. And it's just like, obviously, you know, nobody's at their best when things are tough. But let's recognize that this next few weeks could be tough and I'm gonna try and be at my best. Me too. I was gonna say also, let's not even try to put expectations on ourselves. Let's just like start fresh right now. <coughs> sure. Have a good attitude and try to be patient with everything. I'm gonna have a great attitude. And if anyone um, pisses me off, I'm gonna freaking kill them. I okay. said yesterday, um, <laughs> he, he pushed the, what's the, the, the you know the word. Panic. No. What are the the um, trees on the on the other side of the window? Uh, screen. He, yeah, screen. He pushed the screen out. I don't know if you saw, but he pushed the screen on his on his window out, and he looks at me. He goes, "Don't freak out." <laughs> and I was like, "Oh no!" <laughs> He's all I heard us say, "Like I'm not gonna freak out." <laughs> um. Okay, another thing that's bothering me is I, know. Um, I can't zoom in, so we're from here up, where normally we're here up, oh. and yeah. Oh, and people can't see like our face, our, the real detail of our faces, and now they're looking at your whole torso, which is... Right, which is not great, because the shirt is billowy, although I have been working out. Also, my hair looks different, because I just took a shower and wore a hat for 10 minutes. Doesn't it look good? Everyone... Positive reinforcement. Don't lie to him, obviously, but tell him how good this looks because he doesn't really like love his hair when he gets out of the shower. I know. Also in good news, Whitney. Yeah. I think it's the beginning of season three. That, ooh, and John's here. John's here. <laughs> um, we film on Thursday. Yeah. He comes on Thursday. He should be a special guest. Um, I'm so excited for season three. I hope Justin Bobby appears because can't wait. He's great. Mm -hmm. Okay, I need to screen mirror. Yes. Good lord, if this doesn't work, how hard I'll freak. Huh? No, just be like, if this doesn't work, I'm just gonna be chill. I'll take about a it. deep breath. I'll take a DB and, and we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Are we recording? Yes, we are. Do mm -hmm. I look fat sitting like this? 
You yeah, know, we're not okay. recording. Don't get mad at me. I'm doing we're not basketball. recording the backup audio? Right now, right now, right now. Here it goes. I don't know if you guys know, Whitney got fired as the audio person from this show and then rehired because I, I can't do it. I can't do it. Um, also, there's no one else to do it. <laughs> we couldn't hire anyone. Maybe John. John. I wish you could see John right now. He is dressed like a pool man from like a post-apocalyptic movie. <laughs> He's like, the world is gone, but I'm still going to do my job. He's very concerned about the sun. He's the best. Mm -hmm. He is the best. Lessons last year. I broke up with the love of my so life. So I heard that she was so upset in this scene because she knew he was on drugs and was sad for him. Oh. And my oldest and best friend totally betrayed me. You did something really shady, and you did it behind my back. It wasn't all Brody. It was you. My roommate Heidi started dating a guy that I just didn't trust. Spencer. He walked in with two blonde bimbos. What blonde bimbos? I've never seen him before. And eventually, it tore us apart. He's a Erasing. sucky person. He's a sucky person. Lauren. Heidi finally decided to move Lauren. in with Spencer. If I do this with you, though, you're going to be serious, right? No more messing around, no playmates. Deal. And I knew that our friendship would never be the same. I don't want it to be like I move out and that's the end of it. You know, it's not like that at all. It might be, though, Heidi. <laughs> Heidi, I, I, I might drop you. <laughs> happened since then. Whitney graduated from college, and she got the yeah, job. Yeah, that was real There's footage a world from of my between graduation. Being an intern and an employee. And now she's my boss. <gasps> Audrina and I settled in as roommates, and it's been so much fun. I felt like I had it all back on track. But then I heard something that made me realize that Heidi and I could never be friends again. Oh, what is that? Oh my God, there I am. Oh my God, you have a desk? You're out of the closet and into the corridor. No, it's still the same room. It's just a different setup. Mm. Mm -hmm. Hello, I'm professional. Hey. Hey. Hey, you're late. Get to your desk and <laughs> steam my shirt. That's what I would have said. I look sophisticated. Yeah, you're great. She's in an uh, empire dress. Yeah. Your own desk. I know, so official. Ooh, oh tea. my god, Oops. they moved everything around in here. Yeah, you got new folding chairs. It looks good though. And all the clothes are more organized and everything too. Like mm -hmm. all the sweaters and the shoes back there. So proud of you and your new job. Thank you. Ready to be my boss man? Supposedly. How boss are you doing? Really? I didn't tell you what happened. I like how you're not backing down from this like I'm your boss thing at all. Like like you could have been like, I'm not your boss. Like we're, we're you know, we're we're still the same, but you're like I guess. Because <laughs> I wasn't, like, technically her boss. Right, so. but, she, like, even last season, she was like, so that means you're going to be my boss. And you could have been like, no, it's not going to be like that. But you're like, oh, yeah. <laughs> sorry. Mm. Sorry, not sorry. Mm. I'm going to be your boss. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Lee, how are you doing? I didn't tell you what happened. No. I started having like my friends coming up to me and just telling me like really like rude, horrible rumors. And like the next thing I know, all like the exact same things they were telling me like ended up like on the internet. Horrible. And it got back to like Laguna and my parents. What were the rumors? They basically were saying that like me and Jason made like inappropriate videotapes. Boy. <laughs> Who does that? Did you think that they never covered that on the show? Yeah, I thought, that, I thought that was like <laughs> I thought it was the elephant in the room all the time, but uh, I guess not. Also, this is very fourth wall breaking, like mm -hmm. ended up on the internet. Why? Why would anyone care about what a Teen Vogue intern's like sex tapes were all about? I mean, at this time, they could technically, they could technically probably be like, you know, they posted it on Facebook and all my friends found out or something Right, like right. That. They're definitely but, playing it generic. They're not but like it was, Perez Hilton's like scummy website. <clears throat> Um, Which it was. Yes. Um, you're beautiful. Thank you so much. I just could never understand hating someone so much that you want to do something like that to them. You're like, <laughs> so did you make, so like, <laughs> did you make the taste? My, my reaction though, did they don't make sense to what she's saying. Well, I wouldn't okay. just be like, mm. well, let's see what you do. Okay. Have you heard from Heidi lately? Uh, update okay. on the song. Our neighbor does music clearance and she's like looking into it, but 
we're just gonna, we're, it's unlikely they'll give us permission, so we're just gonna keep singing. Like, you guys can listen to the song on Spotify if you really wanna hear it. <laughs> you ready to sing? Yeah, sure. For you. Open up the dirty window. window. Let the sun illuminate Nate. the words that you, you cannot find reaching. reaching. Is this a new open? The distance. distance. So close you can almost taste, taste it. it. Release your inhibitions. Feel, Feel the rain on your mm -hmm. skin. Mm -hmm. No one else can She's like, come it. here. No, you I'm not even into you. Can let it. New open. No Adrina. No one else that was from the city. The words on your lips. Just something. Drench. Live your life with thumbs wide open. Today is where your book begins. The rest are still on written. Whoa, babe. that was like your vibrato. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to do a Lady Gaga national anthem remake. Oh, Hunger Games. <laughs> oh, say can you see? Excellent. You know what you did. Yeah. This is still. Also, a rumor of a sex tape probably isn't that bad. Say it again. A rumor that there's a sex tape without the actual sex tape being available is not that big of a deal. Yeah. Is that can I? Is that okay to say? Yeah. Like if someone was like, "Oh, I heard you and." I heard you and Timmy. You don't have to whisper, sex. but you just you just don't have to also scream talk. <laughs> because it's like I'm a crazy guy for I keep shushing my wife, but she talks like in this level, and it's like you could also you could also you, just I, talk like that. I feel like anybody. No, no, no. You don't have up, to whisper. Anybody who's grown up in a big family understands why you have to talk so oh loudly. They're like, I need the chicken, <laughs> and if I don't yell, I'm not gonna eat. Um, if someone was like, before we got married and whatever, it was like, I heard you. How to, I'm gonna put a rumor out there that you have a sex tape. Like, I probably wouldn't be friends with them, but I wouldn't, it wouldn't be like that big of a deal, right? No, not, well, okay, two things. First of all, no, it wouldn't be. But just to play devil's advocate, this is pre-Kim Kardashian sex tape, which got out there. But Kim Kardashian sex tape kind of made it okay for sex tapes to be everywhere. Maybe this is a time where like things were more taboo, if yeah, you will, but. Yeah. No, I think so. it would be a huge deal if he was like, I got the sex tape and here it is. Exactly. But also, I, I think maybe the things that were said in the article he said were worse. That but... Lauren and Jason made a sex tape and then said something negative about her body. Exactly. Which, if That's... they put that in the thing, like, yeah, you're dead to me. You yeah. want to, like, yes. Yeah, that Make is fun grounds. of my private parts, like, That's you're grounds, dead to me. That's grounds, yeah, to be dead to me forever. Mm -hmm. But just, hey, they they have a sex tape out there. Quick aside, my roommate around this time found, took my video camera, made a sex tape with his girlfriend and then like moved out and like four years later, I was like, where's my camera? And I found it, I was like, oh, there's a tape in here. I wonder what's on this tape. And it was them having sex. <gasps> oh my sex. God, do you still have the tape? Yeah, I was watching it this morning. No, just kidding. Heidi? Livery. Does she have a, a boob job? You got the TVs? Uh, let me look. What is that? A jelly Looks aquarium. Like <laughs> Oh, what? I didn't even know you were looking for a fish tank. Oh, he got a fish tank. Yeah, I was. Oh, whoa. I need the guest list of who's coming for the housewarming party. First, I was like, why aren't they yes, wearing masks? I don't think we have a guest list because I invite friends and tell friends to invite friends, so I don't know what. So, friend. how many people are coming? I invited Brody, <laughs> Frankie, I invited your boy, I invited Gino, Panero. What about you? Who are you going to Who's your boy? Who's your boy, Gino Panero? Oh, Oh, that was one person? Mm -hmm. I thought I was, I invited your boy, and then also, in addition, Gino Panero. <laughs> I think Gino and Panero are even separate people. We will Google some named Gino <laughs> Panero and put their picture here. Whitney. That's you. I already invited, but that's pretty much it. Let's see if we can get them on the list. What? <laughs> also, at this time, like, the coolest thing you could be was, like, club guy, gatekeeper. Yeah, totally and have like hookups at the clubs. Right. I like his polo preppy look better than his Chrome Hearts. Uh... Yeah. Okay, Adrina. Hey. Yeah, she definitely had a good job. How are you? Good, I haven't seen you in so long. Oh, Adrina How's doesn't know going? how to deal with her. Good. Yeah, you just sit here by yourself. Um, what? Um, I'm the I receptionist. Yeah. A little housewarming party. I wanted to see if you and Lauren wanted to come. Oof. And for both of you. 
If you want to come, I talked to Whitney, and I think she should be coming. Whitney's going to go? Mm-hmm. I don't think I'm going to go. Yeah, I'll still give it to Lauren. Yeah, yeah, so if you guys can come. Yeah. If not, but... Um, but it was good seeing you. I have yes. to go take you to the mail room. Okay, bye. Ooh. Do you want to know what that felt like? What? When Jen Bunny came to Heidi's work. Mm-hmm. Adrena was a little bit even more polite than Heidi was. Can you sing? What an interesting shirt. My God. Heidi just came in here right now. Is she still here? No, she just left. What it's was like, she doing here? She came here to give us housewarming invitations. Oh. No. No need for air quotes there. That's <laughs> exactly what it was. I didn't even tell you this story, but like, she hasn't called Lauren once since she's moved out. We've heard from friends that her and Spencer were talking so much crap on Lauren, saying really mean, mean things, saying that Lauren was no one without Heidi and she could never get in any club without her. That's so pathetic. You know what's the bad thing? Lauren is Lauren's her own TV show. called her. He was like, Lauren, there's these rumors on, on these websites saying that you and Jason have a sex tape out. Oh. And Lauren's like, what? Who called her? I cannot her? even I'm imagine. Sex tape out. Even if these rumors are going on, she could have called uh, Lauren's mom called her. Oh. No, Lauren's mom called Lauren and said, you, you, oh. Lauren's mom called her own daughter and said, I have heard you have a sex tape out. Oh, shit. That would be scary. Out on what? Like, like in Blockbuster? Like, what are they? Well, you know, on the internet. called her and be like, you know, like, I'm sorry, like, are you right. okay? Even if they had nothing to we do with the rumors in the first things. place. We don't have any real proof, but they were <laughs> best friends. And yeah. for Heidi just to stand back and not do anything, and then for her to come in here and give us invitations and expect us to go to her housewarming party, it's not going to happen. Nah, that's really weird. Ugh. Yeah. I mean, I have Lauren's back, regardless. You know where your bread's buttered. Way to go, Adriana. Oh my god, I have to tell you something. So Dream was at work today, and Heidi walked into her work. Really? She came to give us invitations to her housewarming party tonight. Please discuss. <laughs> sunglasses. Talk, tell me about your hairdo. <laughs> Um, my hairdo was a Whitney special. Mm -hmm. um, I braided this piece, mm -hmm. braided that piece, mm -hmm. left a little tendril mm -hmm. out, and put mm -hmm. the rest in a low bun. Love it. Party tonight. It's strange. Does she really think you're gonna go? No. She can't think I'm gonna go. I feel bad not going, but at the same time, I just think I would feel really uncomfortable being there. She's in a different world. Oh well. Hope she has fun. <laughs> Did you have a canker so what story you were avoiding? We're going to Ledoux. You should come. Almost every time I go there, I meet a cute guy. Really? That sounds fun. <laughs> I think I do come. To where? To Ledoux. Sure. <laughs> Look at how many people waiting outside. Oh, Lowe's back. Huh? Same bump it, same love. A little bit of a poo. Oh, Ooh, this is what yes. we do at the club. No, no. Look at this guy I found. This is Jason. Is that mom? I know. Listen, I'm intimidated. You're very good at the show. Come on, Jason. Okay. Lauren's pretty forward with these guys. It's pretty, like, confident. Feel right. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> She's like, I'm gonna take advantage of you tonight. Yeah. Oh my god, these are all crossroads kids. Unbelievable. Way too tasty, Sid. Oh my god, I know every single one of these guys from my high school. That's funny. Hi. It's a shell about your high school. Oh my god. <laughs> Jen Bunny? Spencer better pay me for the Oh my god, Jake Avenue. Hi, nice to meet you. You guys margaritas in here. Your apartment is so cute. Okay. Yeah. Take your sandwich platter rolls. <laughs> I'm sorry, Jen Bunny. I know. Like they had 
Uh, Heidi wouldn't even talk to her last time we saw them together. She's reaching at straws. She needs like to form some sort of team, you know? She needs like a, a support group. So in between seasons, Spencer and Heidi trashed Lauren. And then when they started filming, Heidi pretended like- It wasn't that. None of that happened. Yeah. Email. Yes, you are yeah, American. <laughs> you are. Hi. Oh my god, is this when you say he's not cute? Yeah. Yeah, she is. Uh... No. <laughs> How horrible. I feel like that's kind of a famous moment, it but is how a famous... horrible. <laughs> Do you not think he's cute? I thought he was kind of cute. Let me look at him again, but I wouldn't lie to her. No. I'm so picky. I mean, I look just... at, I've, I've landed my own poet, artist, model, <laughs> YouTuber. Cute? Yes. Um, somehow, like that was mean, what you just did. I but know. somehow, it's not when you do it because like you're so innocent that you're just like, I'm being honest. Yeah, I'm just like, I don't think he's like, <laughs> They're like, move over, um, friend who's not on the show. <laughs> oh. I think I was already drunk too. <laughs> oh, I feel like that guy was like, wait, she's asking if I'm cute? Let me look over. Oh no! He didn't hear, he didn't hear. But he is cute. And there's that he is cute. Mm. I don't know why I'm being like that. Wait, is Lauren American? <laughs> American? I love you. I'm sorry. Refill, Playboy. Let's go, Playboy. It's Friday night. You're 23 years old. Brody's such a good influence. Who wants one? Oh, what a nice party. I'm so <laughs> glad that you came. I'm I so, know. so glad. I'm I miss so you so much. Okay. I'm totally focused on like my my real friendships right now. And like you're a very important person to me. I know. What? I'm oh. just really glad that, you know, I'm here and we're talking. I'm just glad that you're part I'm of my happy. fresh start. You know, I'm glad that you're here to really be a part of all this because, oh, you know, you mean Obviously. so much to me. Did you invite Lauren? I did. I wish, you know, she were here to, like, see how much fun this is. Why, why is Heidi not making eye contact with her? <clears throat> oh, she's looking to see where Spencer is? They kept the harpsichord staying. Um, because that was extremely edited, uh -huh. chopped up scene. Uh -huh. Just a little tidbit for anyone back home, a little <laughs> BTS. Anytime someone is saying something and they're not on screen, like... It, it could be It's probably ADR. taken from somewhere else. Uh -huh. Sorry. But appreciate, that's craftsmanship. Undefeated, it's a, a shoe store right now. Oh my God, cars. Lauren. Lauren, my pants are low rise. It's She's so low low 2000. <laughs> I think the girls' pre party before going out isn't always a good idea. No, no more. We can't start so early. Uh, oh, uh, I no, you should. You were fun. Oh, yeah. What time did you get home? Six in the morning. What? <gasps> Clubs goes at two, biatch. Yeah, that's what I think she was about to say. <laughs> I just farted a little. You did? Like a tiny bubble. Sometimes those tiny ones can be. SBDs, they can be ruthless. Do you smell it? No, I don't. Oh, but I will say your farts don't smell good. But who's do, right? Who's, I was just about to say, who's name do? one person who's whose fart do? you smelled and, and it's been like, mm, Fun story. Not um, bad. Not to interrupt you, uh, but we already made that point. Nobody's farts smell good. Um, well, I invited Whitney to my sister's wedding when we first started dating and we were getting ready and I had to leave to go do something like wedding related and Winnie was in the room by herself and I forgot my keys and I came back. She's taking a huge nap. <laughs> I mean, you guys know at the beginning of relationships you only take a number two and you're not with. Right. So I needed dude. things to be serious. So I was like, let me go back in case she's taking a dump so I can just get that <laughs> over with. And get a whiff of it. Two. What'd you do for four? I can marry you. We went back to Justin's apartment. So you hooked up with him? We made out. Ooh. Who, Justin? Yeah. You made out with that guy from London. Oh, God. You guys kissed a lot. It, no, we didn't. It wasn't oh. just once. Really? Yes. Oh. Is she pregnant? No. 
You know, if you kiss a lot, you could get pregnant. <laughs> Go, Lauren, have some fun. That's yeah. a cute dog. Playboy limo. Where is that? I liked all your friends last night. You know, they love you. Actually. They seem very nice, all of them. Oh, Frankie Even met his friend too? his birthday party at Le Du tonight. Oh, yeah? Is um, Lauren going? Um, she actually just called me. I just missed her call. And I'll call her <laughs> back and ask her. And see what I wish like. that Adrena and Lauren would have come last night. I mean, I totally accept that she doesn't like me, but she shouldn't yeah. take that out on you. I know. Our friendship shouldn't suffer from it. Oh, God. Maybe they didn't spread the rumors. Excuse? It's not ever confirmed that they did. Right? Um, I mean, in real life, I have no idea. In the show, no. They're not... Like, Spencer and Heidi aren't saying, like, I don't, we didn't do that. They haven't said that yet. They seem unaware of the whole situation. Well, it's weird. <laughs> yeah. Cha cha cha. What time do we have to be at Frankie's? Let's go around 10. So I told you I saw Brody, right? Sweet mm -hmm. LA. He came up to me, he was really nice at first, and then he started saying how we didn't go to the house ring party and how he missed out. That's just rude, though. It is really rude. When you've disrespected someone so much, I'm not going to be there for you. You're not, no. Not at and at this point, I have no intention of being there for her. She's oh. done. Yeah. She was done in season one. All I know is thank you for getting out of my life, because now I have a better roommate and a better apartment, and I'm just in a better situation. Mm. Oh, Gina's like, I don't like that either. Yeah. Mm -mm. Cheers. Ricky's birthday. Hey. <laughs> Let's go have fun. Who cares? It's done and over with. It's gonna be a long night. Adriana's always like, let's just go have fun. Right. Like even in real life, she's always just like, we just let's just have fun. And then Lauren's like, mm, it's gonna be a long night. I think so. I'm dying to see if Lauren, Adriana, and Whitney show up to Frankie's birthday. Somebody they've known for three months and they didn't show up to their best friend's house or environment party. But so I wrote like, Lauren a letter about not coming to the house. Don't loop me into party. that though. Let me read these. Well, how about you don't read them? They're personal. Oh. <laughs> okay, so should we go? Oh, look at this. Yeah, you come in handy so often these days. All right, keep it coming. All right. All right. Okay. Why not? Oh my god, is this Let's the third scene of Ledoux this episode? Do people ever get sick of going to the same place? Not when it rocks and there's cute guys you can kiss. That's hey, true. Todd. <laughs> hey, Todd. Oh my god, Justin Bobby's there. I see him. Enter JB. Hey, Todd. Hey, Todd. This was a big night. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! Uh, um, Do you think that she didn't know they were coming? Oh, yeah. I just wanted my go. Hey, Todd. Here, Lauren, I wrote you a letter. Here, Lauren, I wrote you a letter. Okay, Todd's like, I'll kill you. Frankie's birthday! Snap. Uh, Number uh, snap. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! I'll be right back. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Hey, Tom. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. It's our time to get me at the same place. I'm ready to go. Yeah, let's go. Tell me what she did, you know? She acted stupid. Like, what did I do? Why did she get so mad at me? We've heard all the things you guys have been talking about before. I mean, you know, why don't you go talk to her? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'll be back. Okay, Todd's like, can someone put a mic on me? <laughs> I've been here enough. I'm here more than Whitney. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine if he was, like, in the open. It's like... 
took his beanie off. I want to whip you. It's over here. Thank you for coming over for Pat last night. Appreciate I think he looks great. Good friends came. Yeah, I you guys aren't good friends. What did the letter say? Oh, I want to read that. I forgot about it. Oh. Are they at someone's house now? Lauren, I wish you were there. We need to catch up. I really miss you. I understand you don't like Spencer, but I. I know. Didn't why? Do this looks like someone's I house and the you. Call me when you get a chance. P.S. The housewarming party wasn't the same without you. Because she won't admit it. That's her problem, I guess. She'll roll on her. What? She'll roll up on her right now. Yeah. Like, what's your problem? My problem is you spread rumors about my private parts. What is your problem? I don't understand. Honey, you're a different person. Oh, you're not my friend anymore. I don't, I really, I don't care about you. I don't ever, ever want to talk to you. I think that's really sad, Lauren. I think you're really sad. That's reality. That's reality. I feel bad for you. I always feel bad for you, Lauren. Always. No, you're a bad person. What did I do? What did I do? Audrina's like, me too. you through everything and now you're mad at me. It's like, oh, come on. Seriously. You know why I'm mad at you? Why, Lauren? You know why I'm mad at you. You know what you did. What did I do? You know what you did. What did I do? What? How did you brain You're a different person now. You guys are crazy. Yes, you're crazy. What did I do? What did I do? Audrina's You guys are sick people. What did we do? You said, what did you do? What did you do? Say it. You started a sick little room about me. I didn't start any room. Really? Nothing? No. You're a stab in my Oh, yeah. CT? Yes. To be sorry for it all. Who's this? Dude. She's famous and insane. She knows I have a look at you. Okay. Yeah, you don't know what you're making on her. She's going out. You've been hanging on. You're gonna drive him? Don't you know that everything is not all. All right, well, Heidi claims she didn't start the rumor. Right. It sort of seems like she was saying, like, I didn't start it. Like, because Spencer did. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe he did and he didn't tell her that he did. You know? Swingers closed. Oh, so oh my God. I totally Sorry, what did you say? Maybe he started it and didn't even tell Heidi that he did it. Or, like, you know what I'm saying? There's so many different... Possibilities. I went to Ladue for um, oh, Frankie's birthday, right? Uh -huh. So I walked in with Frankie and everyone. Lauren was at the table, right? And she got up from the table and left. So I was like, what? okay, yeah. And it's what? like, I didn't even think the bathroom. Have the <laughs> so I go downstairs to see what's wrong. Uh -huh. And she starts match, like looking at me so crazy. And she's like, you know what you did? And starts screaming at me, you're pathetic. You're brainwashed. Spencer brainwashed you. And I'm just like, what are you talking oh, about? Elodie's like, I, I, like, I'm your friend who doesn't like Spencer. Yeah, remember? Remember? <laughs> hi, hi. Like, what? I don't know. I Where is your EQ, dog? Really friends or, I don't know. She I mean, do you even care? You I mean, I what do. What does EQ like, do mean? Emotional intelligence. I mean, only... Mm. It's my boyfriend. And yeah, I just feel like it's life. more drama than anything. Yeah, it's like I'm not. And then for a child, Adrena, you know? just to take her side. I'm not a like... caddy girl, and I'm not. You know, I don't have time for this one. Forget You're busy it. at Bolt House. She's like, I got a fake job, and I'm on a TV show, and I need to fill up that first tank with crystal light. <laughs> You're like, I'm a boss. Hello. How are you? I'm pretty good. How are you? Good. You look pretty. Thank you. I like your jacket. Thank you. Did you go out last night? No, actually. I took the night off. Did you? It's Frankie's birthday. Oh, yeah? Did you have a good time? It's all right. I got in a fight with Heidi, though. <sighs> Heidi was there? I was in here. Was there a confrontation? She was like, I don't understand why you're mad at me. WTF. <laughs> and she just won't I don't care. responsibility for it. I mean, it's sad that, you know, I lost her as a friend. It's sad the things she did to me. Mm -hmm. But maybe you haven't lost her forever. I don't want a friend that I know I will never trust again. You right. Know, like, it's done. I know. I feel like lately, or at least since I've known you, it's been really difficult with friends. Like, you've had a lot of problems with friends. I'm lucky that I have Lo that moved back. Really? Since I've known you, like, it seems like you're kind of the common denominator <laughs> in all these problems. No. That's what you're saying. I have, you know, you at work, and I have Audrina yeah. in my apartment. But right. 
I literally feel like one of my friends died. You know what I mean? Like mm, half dramatic. friends is gone. So sad. She's just not a part of my life anymore. Maybe that's a good thing. Yeah, and maybe you'll be better off, you know? I am so far. Mm-hmm. Looks like you're also about to cry. Listen to what your teacher said. Da -na -da -ba -da 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 -da. Try to pick your head up in the sky. Lovers, they will cause you tears. Go ahead, release your fears. Stand up and be and don't be ashamed to cry. You gotta be, you gotta be bad, you gotta be bold, you gotta be wiser. You gotta be hard, you gotta be tough, you gotta be stronger. You gotta be cool, you gotta be calm, you gotta be. Uh -uh. All I know, all I know, love will save the day. Yo! That used to be my so favorite song. So many chills! I know that, I know that. And I bet that was the song that was playing. I mean, I don't, that would be crazy. Desiree. We're gonna do a season on now. You ready? Mm hmm. Ready. The complete second season on DVD. Oh. Did something shady. I haven't felt so is... betrayed by best friends in so long. Since on last DVD, summer. Promo for the DVDs. No season on. I think we're too busy. Previously on The Skrills. All right, do you want to take a 15 minute pause to get ready for your premiere? No, I pushed it to one. Let's just stop tape and go right into oh, the next okay, one. okay, amazing. Amazing. Okay, let me pause or stop. No, 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 look. Oh, just don't. Don't stop? We're not done yet. I was, Did you stop? Oh, oh, okay, no, no, you no. You just no, got to say stuff for the okay, end of the yeah, thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, wait, 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 just chill. <laughs> <laughs> Why won't it get focus at the end of the lens? I, I really don't understand. Um, all right. I have to be like wide, you know what I'm saying? And like, I I'm, know. Why do we have to frame up our bellies? Okay, before I forget, since yeah. we discussed about Timmy and I fighting, yeah, you guys should check out my podcast with Wit because we have a bunch of episodes where Timmy and I rehash out fights that we've already had. Sometimes. And figure out kind of like what happened, like how we got through it. Putting our relationship on the line for a podcast. Exactly. So you guys should check that out because um, if you're interested in... Other people's problems. <laughs> That's what we should call your podcast. Other people's problems. <laughs> like, subscribe, peace in the streets. Like, subscribe, peace in the streets. And then do something weird. Um, oh. Ooh, money cracked. <laughs> Money cracked. You nailed it, babe. 